What's going on guys? We are back with an update on the rental property. We're getting so close to being done. We're over here today finishing up the last few things. Hopefully, We've got the appliances to move in. We've got to hook those up. A little bit of painting left and a few cabinets to finish up and we should be good to go. Pretty stoked. It's coming along real nice. What are you working on? Cabinets? Yeah, I just gotta get these last two hinges on. But for some reason, we're missing like we're missing like parts of this one. I'm sure about it, so I had to buy a new hinge. Gotcha. Slight problem with the stove, the gas line is like a large gas line and the connection to the stove is a small one. So I'm assuming Home Depot or Lowe's or someone makes a gas line that is large attaching to the house that goes to the small attachment to the stove. So gotta get one of those before we hook it up. We did plug it in, everything works. Fridge is in, running, looking good. Nice. Aha, problem solved. The gas line that they were using, they actually had a bigger one, so they actually had to have an attachment that was attached to the gas line to the house from the stove. So I was just gonna take the whole gas line to Home Depot and get an attachment, but I found out they had an attachment that we didn't need. So our gas line fits the gas line. We're good to go. Except it's super short, so I'm gonna have to do some gymnastics here. So we almost finished everything today. A few more things, that stove, gas line is too short. Can't get to it to hook it up. So I'm gonna walk you guys through real quick on all the progress. So the front door, Kayla actually got painted. Well, she painted it, not got it painted. And the same color as the cabinets in the kitchen, which will make it kind of match. Pretty cool. We got all of the floors done. The baseboards are all done in the entire house. So we did baseboards all in the kitchen, or uh, new floors all throughout the entire house. And so it's pretty cool. So there's like no transition pieces into the bedrooms. It's just all flooring. Like in here going into your, one of the guest bedrooms, it's all for no transition which is really cool. I just think it looks really nice and smooth. Over here in kind of the dining area, we ended up getting a new... Light fixture. Yeah, thank you. New light fixture. So that makes this room look a little bit more modern and cool. And um, We've got the whole kitchen cabinets all painted. Kayla put on <clears throat> all the hardware. We did gold with the blue cabinets, which turned out really good. We got the appliances in, still, like I said, gotta fix the gas line on the stove. And like today, in the master, I had to finish painting all up there that you guys saw. We cut throughout the whole house. We did paint the entire house. So we painted the master bedroom, the whole living room, the hallways, the kitchen, the extra bedrooms. Like we repainted the entire house. So with the paint, the floors, the baseboards, it turned out just like awesome. It's looking really good. It's pretty cool. I think the baseboards and the floors are probably the biggest thing that are finally finished that took the longest other than painting. But that is about it. I've still got to kind of figure out the sprinkler situation and then we're getting a condenser on the AC and we should be done. Just those last little touch up paint over here in this dining room, fixing the appliances, and good to go. So, pretty stoked, turned out awesome. Other than that, we are pretty much done. We'll do probably one last final update, showing you guys when the house is all cleaned up and fully done and ready to go. So, but yeah, pretty stoked on it. 
Hope you guys enjoy it. This is a fun little series of the house, the property updates and things like that, but it is time to go. That's the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. We'll see you soon.